Hello travelers and riders, welcome to the page. This video is about installation and testing of Mad Dog Scoutex Ox Lights. So stay till the end of the video, especially Honda Highness owners. A number of components are required for installation and I will be saying those. The number one is Mad Dog Scoutex Lights. Number two will be the Wire Harness Pro of Mad Dog. Number 3 is Switch Pro from Mad Dog. Then will be the Universal Light Mounts. And last, this is an additional one which is Lens. I will be installing the lights on the top rack of the crash guard. So let's go. This is the Universal Mount being clamped on to the top rack of the crash guard. And here comes the extended part and the lights will mount over here as can be seen so this is the Scout X and as you can see he is mounting it on the extended portion with the clamps that came with the light you don't have to pay additional for this it comes with the light but the universal you have to take it and it fits in most of the bikes this is the look of the bike after setting both the lights on either side of the crash guard this is the rider view of the lights we have to open the seat and also loosen up the petrol tank so that the wires can go under it towards the light the products of Mad Dog are really very good, they are very sturdy, they are flame proof, waterproof and uh, I have not given a, a review of these products as you will get a number of those in YouTube. This is just an installation video as I was seeing very few of them for Honda Highness. So I thought that I should make a video regarding the same. The installation of Scout X is not a tough one but the main issue is the dressing up of the wire because the wire should not sag the wire should not be tight and all these points can only be handled by a seasoned mechanic here you can see the wire harness has been brought to the front of the bike and there are four wires coming two to the lights one to the switch and one to the ignition The red wire from the harness will be connected to the positive terminal of the battery and the black one will be connected to the negative terminal of the battery. As of now only the red terminal is connected, the black one will be connected after all the work is over. Now the switch pro is being installed. I am installing on the right hand side of the bike. You can install it anywhere you wish as per your comfort. This switch is really cool, it has a LED indication and uh, when you switch it on, it glows red. The auxiliary lights and the switch is now being connected to the harness and next step will be connecting of the ignition of the harness to the ignition of the bike which is a tricky one. You have to go inside the headlamp where you will get the ignition of the bike. The headlight is open now and uh, I will show you the ignition connection. There is no additional ignition connection in Honda Highness and you can see that the connectors are not compatible. So we had to make an adjustment. We had to cut out a piece of the ignition wire and we installed the same in the connector of the bike so that the circuit can be completed.
you will be getting four to five cable ties with the harness but if you are up for more safety and better dressing you can go for more The relay which comes with the harness is kept under the seat and it is now being tied with a cable tie so that it doesn't move around and create a knocking sound when the bike moves. Moreover, it is an additional precaution so that the relay doesn't get sucked inside the airline which is also under the seat. The lights are on as you can see and the next test is to see how it works in the dark. So stay tuned to see the results. So here we are to check the performance of the aux light. This is the stock light now on. Now we switched on the high beam and now we will be switching on the aux light. And once we switch it on it is much more bright and you can see the red indication on the switch also glowing. The road is much better illuminated and bright. So the performance is satisfactory. If you feel the same do like and share the video and also comment on the video to give your views. Thank you.